What's up, you guys? I just want to make another Regicopter Classic one take low effort video on. Uh, this time, I'm going to show you how to quickly bypass the clutch safety switch and also adjust your clutch pedal. Now, uh, don't worry about the absolute diabolical drip, but um, oh my, this is bad. Uh, basically, you know how when you start your car, if you, if, you go to, if you go to start your car, it won't start unless you clutch it. And now that I did that, I can go like, I'm not clutching and I can just, you know, you know how it is. If you're looking this up, I'm assuming you know what that means. So I'm just gonna go under the little dash real quick. Ah, ah. Okay, so when you're under here, here you got your, oh wow, this is zoomed in, clutch pedal. And here's your whole assembly for the clutch pedal. Now for the clutch safety switch, there's gonna be two little switches on your clutch pedal. There's gonna be that gray one up, oh, nope. There's gonna be this gray one up here that goes for this and there's gonna be like this yellow one here. Now, the gray one, I think that's for cruise control. I don't know, but there's gonna be a plug on this yellow one. And you can see it's unplugged because, well, let me find mine. Whoop. There's gonna be this, this thing is gonna be plugged in. Now, basically all this is, is this is the clutch safety switch and you just have to bypass it. So what you have to do is just, you know, unplug it and just jump. There's only to be two, you just jump it. And that way it'll think the clutch is in all the time uh regarding like trying to start the car so it'll be bypassed and so you can just start the car it thinking it's all the way in and so yeah you just jump it uh 18 cage solid core fits in there snugly perfectly i used strand and just taped it to make sure it wouldn't fall apart uh but you know how it is next up to just the clutch pedal now when i got this car the clutch grabs super high and i have an e36 and it's like super uh that grabs super low so i kind of wanted to see if i can make this grab lower and i looked it up and there's just a there's just a little I found a forum thing with the thing telling you how exactly to adjust it. Uh, I suggest you read that and look at the diagram before you do it. And it's pretty simple. But first, I mean, pretty much you just gotta. Uh, there's two things of adjustment here. This is the clutch switch for I think like I said I think the cruise control. I'm not sure, but we just want to make sure that this uh, this the threads on the switch doesn't touch the grommet on this uh, blue thing here, and then you can use this nut. You can loosen this nut and adjust this to just make sure there's just a little gap there. And then uh, on the actual clutch pedal adjustment itself, I wonder if I can get around here. It might be upside down. Ooh, my fingers. Okay, so yeah, this is just the push rod. This is, the other one was a 17. This is a 12. You just loosen this and then you grab onto this. You can see I kind of scratched up. I just use needle nose pliers. Like, I think it's, mine's a shit box. If you want to do it, you could probably use vice grips or pliers and like a cloth it's not the easiest thing to spin but it's also not the hardest thing easier oh not the hardest thing also and so you just loosen this and you can back this off and forward depending on how far up you want your clutch pedal to sit and i adjusted mine not all the way but almost all the way and it's like my e36 right now so you actually get plenty of adjustment i wasn't expecting to be able to uh put it down this low i'm actually gonna back it off a little bit because i'm worried that i'm uh, I did it too much, and I'm just, like, riding the clutch in a way, and, like, uh, affecting... Wait, no! Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, I'm worried, uh, I'm not bottoming, bottoming out the clutch all the way, so I'm gonna, uh, loosen this, and then adjust this to, to come, uh, out of these threads more, so the clutch pedal sticks up more. But it's, it's, it's pretty simple, it's just you kind of have to know how to do it, I guess. And, uh, well... That's kind of it. Good luck.